Now, the iPhone has these uh, applications, these um, programs called apps. There's a little simple application, a little simple program. And some of them are very serious in nature. A lot of them are games or, or funny in some way. And there's this one which has been controversial last week or so called the Ugly Meter. I don't know if you've heard of the Ugly Meter or not. But the reason it's controversial is because of, of the self-esteem problem we have in our culture, right? And uh, taunting and making fun of people. And, of course, in, when I was a kid, we never taunted anybody. <laughs> there was no bullying around when I was growing up. It's a modern phenomenon only recently discovered. <laughs> but anyway, the only thing is controversial because uh, it measures how good-looking you are. And uh, it, on a scale of 1 to 10, with 1 being the best and 10 being the worst. So, for example, if you get a 10, it'll tell you that you had a 10, and then it will describe how ugly you are with some kind of, uh, you know, colloquial expression. For example, you look like you ran a 100-yard race in a 90-yard gym. <laughs> Isn't that terrible? This is horrible. It uses uh, uh, facial recognition software and, and, and gauges almost entirely on symmetry. I couldn't resist this. <laughs> I could not resist it. It's only 99 cents. So um, before I go on, let me tell you that I've always believed I was only passively good looking. And I've oftentimes thought to myself, why did my wife marry me? I mean, there were guys she was dating a lot better looking than me. Why did she marry me? And this has kept me humble in our relationship and very grateful in our relationship, you see. So she's encouraged this kind of feeling on my part as much as she can. <laughs> so uh, I got the app for 99 cents. I held the camera up to my face. Here's my iPhone right here. In fact, I got the ugly meter online right now. And what does it say right there, Brad? Uh, ugly meter. See, I'm telling the truth, right? Let me get you a picture, Brad. <laughs> so I held it up and I took my picture. And then it go, I, I could actually see a grid being superimposed on my face, and it was starting to calculate. And then after maybe 15, 20 seconds, it gave me my score, 3.9. And then it gave me my, my uh, little slogan, hot enough to melt ice. <laughs> And you're saying right now, that thing's not very accurate. <laughs> so I said, honey, listen, I, I, did my, I took my face, picture my face, and it, it measured me, and it gave me 3.9, hot enough to melt ice. And it works on, on symmetry. She says, well, a big, round, fat face is symmetrical. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't care what she thinks. But anyway, <laughs> when I saw that I was hot enough to melt ice, I got a little bit more pep in my step. I got a little bit more joy in my heart because somebody somewhere thinks I'm good looking. I like that very much. <laughs>